Welcome to the spoken tutorial on the importance of sulfur. In this tutorial, we will learn about benefits of sulfur, symptoms of its deficiency, sulfur rich food sources. Sulfur is the third most abundant mineral found in our body. Most of it is derived from sulfated amino acids. Amino acids make up the proteins. There are 22 amino acids. Out of 22, a few of them have sulfur. The most important sulfated amino acids are methionine and cysteine. Methionine cannot be synthesized in the body. Hence, it has to be taken from the diet. On the other hand, cysteine is synthesized in our body. However, it requires a steady supply of sulfur. Methionine and cysteine cannot be stored in the body. The excess amount is excreted through urine. Otherwise, it gets stored in the form of glutathione. Glutathione is an antioxidant produced in the liver. It protects the cells from damage and against various diseases. It also helps to remove toxins from the body. Many other compounds have sulfur too. Let us have a look at the importance of those compounds. I will first tell you about keratin. Keratin is found in the outer layer of the human skin. For healthy hair, nails and cell growth, we need keratin. Chondroitin sulfate is another compound that has sulfur. It delays the breakdown of cartilage in joints, improves joint mobility, might help in relieving pain caused by osteoarthritis. Osteoarthritis is a condition where joint cartilage begins to break down. Another sulfur containing compound is alpha lipoic acid. Energy production and enzyme function requires alpha lipoic acid. It also helps in lowering blood sugar levels. Apart from proteins, some B vitamins also contain sulfur. One of them is vitamin B1 which is also known as thiamine. We require thiamine for normal development and growth. It is also required during reproduction and breastfeeding. Biotin is another B vitamin which has sulfur. Biotin is important for healthy hair growth. It plays a role in cell signaling and the regulation of genes. Let us now see the several roles of sulfur in our body. Sulfur helps in the process of digestion, protecting the lungs from mucus formation and infections, maintaining healthy eyes, reducing the chances of development of cataract in the eyes, developing the central nervous system and building a strong immunity. Insulin production also requires sulfur. Sulfur is also required during synthesis of collagen. Collagen is a protein found in bones, muscle and skin. It strengthens the skin. Production of hormones like cortisol also requires sulfur. Aldosterone and testosterone are other examples. I will now tell you the various functions of these hormones. Cortisol helps to control blood sugar levels and reduces inflammation. It is also called a stress hormone. Aldosterone's main role is to regulate blood pressure. Testosterone is a male sex hormone. It helps in building bone mass and muscle density. 
let us look at the symptoms of sulfur deficiency. Deficiency of sulfur causes wrinkling of skin, brittle hair and nails. Joint pain, convulsions and memory loss are also seen. Apart from this, toxins accumulate in the body. This can increase the risk of cancer. The risk of type 2 diabetes and heart diseases also increases. Gastric issues, rashes and delayed wound healing have also been observed. We will now look at some food sources rich in sulphur. There is no recommended dietary allowance for sulphur. It is recommended to consume sulphur rich food daily. Foods rich in methionine and cysteine are good sources of sulphur. Eggs, fish, and chicken are good sources of methionine. Nuts, milk, seeds and grains also contain methionine. Chicken, cheese, eggs and legumes are good sources of cysteine. Next, we will look at the vitamin rich food sources that have sulphur. Whole grains, chicken, beans and nuts are sources of thiamine. Whereas, goat liver, egg, fish, nuts and seeds have biotin. Sulphur is also present in garlic, onion, cabbage and cauliflower. Remember to include these foods in your daily diet for good health. This brings us to the end of this tutorial. Thanks for joining.